other considerations. In addition to normal and or ideal driving conditions, there are several other considerations that we need to be aware of as an operator of a district vehicle. These considerations could also apply when operating your personal vehicle on district business or otherwise. Here are a few examples. Nighttime. When driving at night, headlights should be on 30 minutes before dusk and remain on until 30 minutes after dawn. It is also important to ensure that both headlights are operational. If one is out, get it fixed as soon as possible, as the other one could soon follow, leaving you without any headlights. Make sure you are not solely dependent on automatic headlight features. Plan your trips to minimize nighttime driving, especially when driving to an unfamiliar territory. And never drive when tired or sleepy, whether at night or otherwise. Inclement weather can happen at any time. It could be rain, snow, or ice. They all present situations that need to be considered and deserve special attention. Always follow the rule that, when wipers are being used, headlights must be on as well. It is extremely important that your wipers are in good condition before you need them and that your wiper fluid is full and functional. In the case of road surfaces that are wet or covered with ice or sleet, reduce speed and increase the following distance. As an additional safety reminder, use caution when entering and exiting the vehicle. Do not use your cruise control under these conditions as it increases your chances of hydroplaning. Loose items inside the vehicle. It is very important to practice good housekeeping inside your vehicle, but also for safety as well. Any loose items in the floorboard can impact the ability to use the pedals properly. In addition, consider that in the unlikely event that you are involved in an accident, anything that is not secured in the cabin of your vehicle could potentially become a projectile. District vehicles should always have the proper tire pressure. Before driving a district vehicle, especially the periodic reservation vehicles, make certain you know all the aspects for operating the vehicle such as horn, lights, emergency flashers, windshield wipers, etc. If a district vehicle is involved in a collision, refer to the accident kit stored in the glove compartment of each district vehicle. There, you will find the accident procedures checklist, the accident report form, and business cards to distribute claim and contact information. If inside or outside the DFW Metroplex and a district vehicle suffers a mechanical breakdown, contact the district security dispatch at 972-600-5134 to receive instructions as to what to do next. Follow all state and local traffic laws at all times. In the event that you find yourself in a situation where you need roadside assistance, please follow these guidelines. Number one, call Irving ISD Security at 972-600-5134 and follow instructions. Number two, the district will arrange for assistance, repair, and a rental vehicle if needed.